Welcome to part two of the fossil preparation series of Alice the Triceratops. Today, we're gonna to be removing the plaster jacket that surrounds the skull, with the goal of exposing the left horn and the forehead. We'll be removing the matrix from on top of the bone and stabilizing any pieces that are loose. We'll start by removing the matrix, or sediment, from on top of the bone. The term matrix is used for any sediment or rock that surrounds a fossil. I'll use acetone to loosen up some of the sediment. This is a paleobond structural adhesive. Unlike other thinner paleobonds, this one is meant to hold large pieces together. Considering that the horn is an appendage that sticks out, it's best to make sure that every part is stabilized and the structural integrity is sound. There's some of the bone exposed. See those lines? Those are blood vessel grooves that are indicative of a keratin sheath which covered the horn. These grooves are prevalent throughout the skull, indicating more keratinous covering in different places. If you think about it, dealing with tyrannosaurs, as well as other triceratops, would require this animal to have some sort of hardened covering over its face. I'm starting to see cracks that are separating the bone. I'll go ahead and secure them. Now that the left horn is stabilized, I'm gonna go ahead and work on the spaces between the two horns. There seems to be some sort of carbon-rich, fossilized plant material. I'll go ahead and secure it and save it. I'll remove this loose top level of matrix. Now 
Next, I'll remove more of the plaster jacket. This portion of the skull would be where the parietal, otherwise known as the frill, would meet the base of the right brow horn. But as you could tell, the right brow horn is missing. So now that I've identified where the bone is exposed, I'll be able to determine how much matrix needs to be removed. Think of this area as the right temple of the skull and the eye is just to the right. In the next video, I'll be uncovering Alice's eye, nose horn, and snout. This is the second installment of the Alice preparation series. We have the Skull X Triceratops Skull preparation series as well. If you like the preparation of Alice, feel free to like and subscribe to the channel. Links to our website, Patreon, and TikTok are in the description below. Stay tuned for more dinosaur fossil preparation content.